Uh, hi there, I'm Miriam and welcome to Miriam's Manor. You guys, I am so very excited today because I have completed my 2021 Christmas Village and today I am releasing for you part six, which is my ski mountain setup. So I will be releasing a full Christmas Village tour video probably within the next week. But I hope you enjoy the final part of my Christmas Village setup for 2021. Check it out and let me know what you think. I am beginning this build the same way I started setup four and five. I already have my table set up as well as the automated ski lift and this is the space that I'm going to be working with. I have glued together scrap pieces of styrofoam here to make a staircase coming down from the neighborhood off of this platform. I'm going to begin by working with this smaller table first that's in the middle. And I cut a piece of styrofoam to size and I added it to the top surface. Next, I use my staple gun to staple cardboard walls to the MDF tabletop and the wooden legs. I am adding snow to the front of this wall and attaching this snow blanket with my hot glue gun. So the front side is now complete and I've moved the table back into place behind the neighborhood. And this is what it looks like from the front. And I'm just going to repeat the same process for this side wall and add snow to this as well. I am adding my Limax outdoor skating rink to this area and I added a few trees on the side, a staircase, snow flurries, trees, and a stone wall, and this level is done. Moving on to the top section of the platform, I used my precision engraver tool from Hotwire Foam Factory to carve a walk path directly into this styrofoam, and I painted it. I added some hedges to the side and blanket snow from Buffalo Snow Brand to both sides of the walk path. And then I added this simple base that I made right behind it and I put my Limax Ski Lodge on top and added a few accessories and figurines. And now I'm going to move on to my ski slope. I used a thin sheet of plywood and screwed it into the existing two tables that I already had my automated ski lift attached to. I used my hot glue gun to glue down the ski poles for my ski racing net. And I also went ahead and laid down the snow blanket to the right side of the ski slope and added my sweaters. And next I glued down some twinkle lights that I picked up from Walmart that will line the ski racing net. And those are set in place. So I laid my snow directly over both pieces. The poles automatically come right through and then I just move the snow blanket out of the way off of the light bulb. I added my skiers, trees, and a few other accessories and now it's time to give you a tour.
Thank you guys so much for checking out my grand finale to my Christmas Village setup. I want to send a big, big, big thank you to Robin Wright because this automated ski lift that you guys see in the video, he gifted to me this year for my birthday and a Christmas present. So I absolutely love it. Thank you so very much, Robin. I will cherish this piece for the rest of my life until I can pass it down to my children. So. If you guys have any questions for me, leave me a line in the comment section. I will get back with you. Also, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up for the video and subscribe to the channel. I also am available on Etsy at this information below, as well as I created a Facebook page and it is the same under Miriam's Manor as well. So I hope to see you guys very soon, probably sometime early next week. And until I see you again, stay safe, God bless you, and I hope to see you soon. Bye.